morning sunshine good morning sunshine your sister's already up how about you hmm? sarah Zupa dupa, show off Zupa dupa. So we spent the night in uh, Newcastle and now we are ready to move on to the next place. We're gonna head in the north direction up the New South Wales coast. Hi! Good morning! Singing bridge. Let us sing. Uh, yeah, very nice here. My all links. Mommy, later can we go to that playground that we caught just now? Caution, koala. Koalas cross here. Okay, so girls, uh, keep your eyes peeled. We'll see whether you can spot some koalas. Okay. Here we are at Mungo Beach. I'm gonna take the walking track and a bit. Looks like we're the only ones. Um, we are parked here at the D's Corner car park and we're getting ready to spend some time at the beach. Weather is not so hot. So, yeah. done with the beach and we are continuing on with our journey along the way the GPS brought us to a river and 
we would need to take a ferry, car ferry, to get across. Thanks, mate. Thank See ya. You. Thank you. Bye. 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 Merry Christmas. So we've made a little pit stop right here um, in a township called Southwest Rocks and we're here at Trial Bay Gaul or Jail. Not sure how it's pronounced. Oh you wanna check it out? Okay, so from the looks of things, this used to be a jail uh, many many years back. Let's go have a look at the history film. Chow Bay Gaul Jail was established in the late 19th century as a public works prison to specifically to house and often prisoners brought to build the brick water. Check it out! Mm. Go in and see. There is No idea. Lord Hacker Zipper gets in 1917. Merry Christmas again. My name is Eva Matthew. This letter is to go forward when the war is over and when there is a chance of these lines to reach you. The prisoner of war are not permitted to write to his friends for a team. Because it was uh, in the past. Daddy, 
might not live at me, but if it's that guy anymore. Oh, they, they've moved to another jail. Why? Uh, cause this is a very old one. What was this area? Oh, this is the kitchen. Cooks served up to 120 prisoners per day during the public works works period. Breakfast was tea, bread and jam, but the midday meal, usually a meat stew, was more substantial than at other prisons of the time thanks to prison reform. These are the punishment cells. Five punishment cells were gloomy crypts into which light never penetrated once the cell doors were closed. Ooh, let's check it out. The men who dared to escape. From silent agony to execution. Love, murder, and the hangman's noose. Prior to the warder opening a cell door, the prisoner was forced to stand against the rear wall in line with the warder's spy hole. This was to ensure the prisoner could not attack the warder. Oh. How Cool. Can you see the prisoner standing against the rear wall? Yeah. Can I see? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you see somebody there? Yeah. Somebody is like, nose is bleeding. His nose is bleeding? Yes. See this thing there? Yeah. It's used to tie the prisoner and to whip him for punishment. Oof. Yeah, typhoid. The gulls' period of use during World War I ended in May 1918. Huh. <laughs> Thank you. 
Check it out! You see there's a windmill just as we are going to be entering the town. What, what is this? What is this? It's a wind... It's a restaurant? No, it's a motorhome. Big windmill. Yeah, that's cool. 